23 people have been killed in Tacoma so far in 2021. This tragic number keeps increasing year after year. This graph shows the total number of homicides in the city between January to July over the last five years. And in the last two months, it's spiked. According to the numbers, August and September has seen an increase of homicides by more than 50% compared to the rest of the year in Tacoma. And that's just unacceptable. Homicides are just one of several crimes on the rise in the city. Tacoma is also seeing an increase in arsons, stolen vehicles, and assaults. City Council member Robert Toms says something has to change. Enough's enough and we need to do something about it. And I'll be putting money in our upcoming budget discussions to do so. Numbers from August show Tacoma police have openings for 16 patrol officers. And in the last couple of years, there has been a hiring freeze and reduction in staff. We've been below size of an average police force since 2008. Toms tells me his hope is to invest millions towards having a larger presence. That's both patrol officers and community service officers. Maybe you have a police force that has these CSOs who don't have weapons. I, I welcome that. I don't think every time someone shows up, they need to have a gun. I think that's fair. Um, but someone needs to show up. And right now we have people that call the police and they don't get a response for two plus hours. Unacceptable. Tom says he believes investing in law enforcement is investing in the safety of the people in the city and hopefully working to put a stop toward this increase in crime year after year. Reporting in Tacoma, A.J. Janivel, Fox 13 News.